Hello, dear students. Hope you're doing well. Well, in today's lecture, we are going to carry on um, what we have seen last time. So, we did uh, how we did how to write a CV or a resume uh, to apply for a job. And for today's lecture is writing a cover letter or an application letter. So here. Uh, you can we can say a cover letter or an application letter so it is the same okay so we have seen that uh, to make your CV successful we have uh, to accompany it with a cover letter okay so let's start Definition of application layer. Where here application layer means, uh, well, in its equivalent in Arabic, we can say risalat talab amal or risalat hafizia. Okay. So a layer of application, also known as a cover letter, is a document sent with your resume or CV to provide additional information about your skills and experience to an employer. The layer of application is intended to provide detailed information on why you are a qualified candidate for a job. So here in the cover layer or the application layer here, don't simply repeat what, what's on your resume or, your, or in your CV, but rather you can include here a specific information on why you are a strong match for the employer's job requirements. You think that uh, your cover letter uh, as a sales pitch that will market your credentials and help you get the interview. So here the, the employer, if he, if he or she uh, see that your letter is strong and you have uh, skills and ex experience here uh, from your cover letter, he or she can uh, call you for a job interview. And this is the main important to get to get this job okay so this is it for the definition we have cover letter components what should be included in your cover letter so as with all cover letters uh, a job application letter is divided into sections so we have sections just like in cv we have seen in cv that we have sections also in a cover letter we have sections we have the heading which includes your name and contact information of course your email uh, the phone number your name and family name etc okay we have a greeting here a greeting means address to a specific per person if possible here we use uh, the greetings we know like dear, for example, dear Mr. or dear Mrs. or don't know, uh, dear maybe, uh, dear the boss or hello the boss, etc. These are greetings, including in a, in a cover letter. We have the introduction, which should include why the applicant is writing. So here the reason that you writing for. Then we have the body, which discusses your relevant qualifications. Here we are talking about your experience, your skills, okay, any additional information that you didn't, okay, uh, include it in your resume or CV. Then we have the close, okay, which thanks the reader and provides contact information and follow-up details just to close and you can say uh, thanks etc we will see all in the template your signature to end the letter so here your signature okay uh, to end this letter for example uh, you can sign with your name or whatever 
okay so here we have um, uh, a template okay or a sample of an application letter we have John Donaldson so we have the address of John Donaldson Donaldson here we have Sue Circle Smithtown CA 08067 we have his uh, contact information he added a phone number and of course his mailbox email okay we have uh, August 14 2020 or the day okay you write this application letter okay George Jill uh, Holy time union so here it's the uh, for whom okay you are going to send this email okay so the address we have dear mr. Holy, which is here the greeting this is the greet the section of greeting I'm writing to apply for the programmer position advertised in the Times Union as requested I enclose a completed job application my certification my resume and three references so here these are uh, the documents accompanied accompanied with uh, his cover letter the role is very appealing to me and I believe that my strong technical experience and education make me a highly competitive candidate for this position my key strength that would support my success in this position include so here these are the strengths okay of John Donaldson which are I have successfully designed developed and supported live use application I strive continually for excellence and I provide exceptional contributions to customer service for all customers so with a BS degree here BS degree means Bachelor of Science okay it's just like uh, Master of Science in our case so this is the Bachelor of uh, Science degree in computer programming. So he has a Bachelor of Science degree in computer programming. I have a comprehensive understanding of the full life cycle for software development projects. I also have experience in learning and applying new technologies as appropriate. Please see my resume for additional information on my experience. I can be reached any uh, time via email at John Donaldson. Okay, this is his email. Or by cell phone, which is the phone number. Okay, so here just like to end his, um, to end his letter. All right and of course thanking him thank you for your time and consideration I look forward to speaking with you about this employment opportunity sincerely John Donaldson here the uh, the sin signature and of course John Donaldson which is the sender of this letter so here is just a sample here you can find a plenty of okay many and many of samples available in the internet but this is these are the main sections of a cover letter all right now we have tips for writing a strong cover letter here get off to a direct start so in this section here are talking about your first paragraph okay and of course it should be short and to the point so here you can explain why you are writing this uh, cover letter mention the job title and company name and also where you came across the job listing here while you can also briefly mention uh, why you are a strong candidate all right then we have offer something different than what is in your resume or CV. 
so of course yeah you can make your language a bit more personal here in one writing this letter uh, then of course here the the language used in um, in the CV is a bit different than that used in a, in a cover letter okay so here you can tell a narrative maybe like a brief narrative about your work experience and career so and should be of course different from what you included in your CV don't just repeat what you what you've written in your resume or your CV okay make a good case ie it means that emphasize your strengths your first goal of course with this letter is what is to progress to the next step which is what is the next step in a in a cover letter uh, of cover of submitting a cover letter and a cv here to call you for an um, a job interview this is what is your goal okay so of course here your overreaching goal of course is to get a job offer okay uh, use your application letter to further both of these causes here offer details about your experience and background that show why you are a good candidate and okay here you deserve to be in this position you deserve to get this job so how have all the jobs prepared you here we are talking about experience for the position what would you bring to this position or this job and to the company what is something like new what the benefits you are going to bring okay to this company and use this space of course you have said to emphasize here this the, the section to emphasize your strength which is most important okay and at the end close with all the important details here you can include a thank you okay as we have seen in the template uh, at the end of your letter here you can also share your contact information okay as the we have seen uh, if you would like mention also how you will follow up so these are uh, tips okay how to write a strong or successful application layer or cover layer so this is all for today's lectures thank you for your kind attention see you next time